Well, the Republicans uh, adopted a strategy of packing the courts when Democrats were asleep on this, on this, on this topic. And, of course, the most egregious example is the stolen Supreme Court seat. And uh, just to put that very clearly, 15 times in our history there has been an open seat during election year on the Supreme Court. 15 times the Senate has debated and 50 time, 15 times the Senate has voted. So only at number 16, the first time what happened last year, uh, was the very first time that the Senate did not exercise its advice and consent deliberately to pack the court. I think uh, many folks in the Democratic world said, yes, it's evil, but they won't succeed because Trump won't win elections, so I won't worry about that. I'll fight other battles. And unfortunately, that became a massively important. That, uh, for the rest of my life, as long as Neil Gorsuch is on that, it's going to be an asterisk. Uh, I uh, don't feel that he has legitimacy to be on the court and that uh, Roberts should certainly have spoken up as the chief justice and, and said to the Republicans, you need to exercise your responsibility. You can vote somebody down, but to simply not vote at all is, com is totally unacceptable. And so we have a damaged Senate and a damaged Supreme Court out of that battle. And we're going to have decisions that hurt we the people in our battle for, for the, the country we envision, that foundation for all families to thrive, in issue after issue after issue. After